management and department heads. Although no one will lose their jobs, in all, it's an 18 percent loss in wages. My, my uh, intent is to try to keep everyone employed uh, so that we can continue to deliver services to the city of Trotwood and minimize any impact to the employees' lives. Trotwood Fire Battalion Chief Bill Hoover says he'll still feel the impact, but thankfully things are not looking dire for his family. Well, I won't go hungry, but unfortunately I think I can't say that for the rest of my city employees. Well, those pay cuts will go into effect July 31st, but what about the union members, the majority of the employees here in the city of Trotwood? Well, Lucking says he's asked the same of them, but he's still in negotiations with the unions. Reporting live in Trotwood, I'm Holly Samuels, 2 News on your side. Okay, Holly, thank you. Dayton firefighters approve a new contract with the city of Dayton. Members of Local 136 agreed to a deal that prevents layoffs and ensures public safety. Firefighters will not get a raise in 2010 or holiday pay for four holidays this year or next. Union and city leaders say they're happy to have negotiations complete.